Good day, YouTube! It's Stratoartica9000 here again with another great battle video. Uh, if you just saw that, I kind of switched up my battle recorder, which is pretty nice. Just figured that out. That's kind of new. But... Well, anyways, this is my first Smogon battle. Uh, I went up against a guy named ShivDog17 or something like that. It's a pretty neat battle, but I was kind of upset I didn't get to use my Tornadus in this match. Uh, if you look at its moveset, if you ever see it one day, it's I kind of got a little bit of influence from Flame and Spade, but yeah. So I lead off with my Politoed anyway. I hit him with a Hydro Pump and get 50% health. And he hits me with a Stab Psychic. That really doesn't do anything. I'm still not clear on why you put a Flame Orb on Cresselia. It's not like it's going to do anything, unless it had Crusade, but yeah. So I hit him with another Hydro Pump thinking that he's going to stay in. That yeah, really doesn't do much, and I really, I just need to get out of here. So I switch out, and I go into my Electivire. And yeah, I keep bringing this guy back. And Tropisaur, I mean Tropius is just a complete waste of my time. It's got Harvest, Citrus Berry, and Substitute. It's really annoying. It's like, I just want to kill this thing. Why is a dinosaur trolling me? And it's got leaves for wings. I just hate it. It's almost as bad as a Zegidor. So I just go with the Fire Punch. Which is kind of pointless. So I don't break its substitute. And it just goes for a Toxic. I'm like, you're kidding me. This is really annoying. So I switch out again, and I go into my Trolling Durant. This thing's pretty neat, I've used it a couple times. I've come close to sweeping an entire team with it once. It's really won me a lot of battles. So I go for a Home Claws, it's got uh, Hustle, so I already got like a 1.5 multiplier, and now I'm up to 2 times attack, thanks to Home Claws. So he goes with an Energy Ball which does no damage whatsoever and he switches out and he goes into his Cresselia again and I think I just go for the x Scizor or no I go for another Home Claw bringing me up to 2.5 attack and this means like a god right now it's got like so much attack like considering that it's got the 2.5 boost and it's already got about 317 attack got a nice 750 attack right now, and that easily destroys Cresselia. So he sends out his Chandler, I haven't seen one of these in a while, and I epically dodge a Stab Fire Blast, and I go with a Stone Edge and kill him in one hit. It's just beautiful. Leave it to Durant to put on a great performance. Almost as good as all that remains. So he sends in his Rhyperior. And... Yeah. So I go with another x -Sizzler. And then that does a neat amount of damage. And guess who misses a Stone Edge? That's right, Rhyperior. So I just pick him off with the next Scizor. Ah, I just love my Durant. Such a troll, yet so beautiful. And then he sends in his shiny Jirachi. I just go with another X Sizzler. And chances are it's going to use Thunder Wave on me. Get some paralysis. Yup. Look how it barely lives, too. It's got like, like maybe 30 hit points. I'm like, really? You've got to be kidding me. So, yeah, he goes with a fire punch, and he hopes that it, I'm going to die, but, mm, try again. So I just go with that sizzler and kill that in one as well. And that's like, I'm up to, I think I'm about up to four Pokemon kill with that thing now. I don't know, but he goes with his swallow. I think this is the one that takes me out, yeah. 
Yeah, this is this one takes me out. He's got flame orb, facade, and he's got guts. Oh wait, no, he uses brave bird. Naturally, oh, now I get why he uses brave bird because I'm part bug type, but still. Oh well. That was pretty nice performance, Durant. So I send in my experimental Weavile set, nicknamed Lemons. I'm not sure what I was thinking when I named it, but... Hey! Who cares? So this thing's choice banded, and it's got Ice Shard. Pretty neat combo, but I still like the Zoomerel huge power choice band combo instead. It's got more power to it. But still, like I said, this is experimental. And yeah, it was actually a good thing I brought up because I just get another ice shirt on this trope highest and times four weakness to ice, it easily goes down. And yeah, that's the game. That was actually a pretty quick match, to be honest. Probably one of the quickest ones I've ever done. So I guess that's the end. Uh, recently I got a five star trainer card. It's pretty neat, but. I'm kind of not proud of it. I did a little hacking on my part. Like, I had a Spirit on with one regard and an Articuno with no guard, which I deleted after I got the five star trainer card. You guys will probably never see any hacks in your life, so don't get scared. I promise. And, uh, yeah, this thing's still going, isn't it? Oh, well, I guess I could keep talking for a few minutes or so. Well, a couple weeks ago when Smogon banned uh, Thunderous and Excadrill to the Uber tier, I was like, what? I'm upset about Thunderous because Thunderous, you got a lot of weaknesses against him, and Thunderous is actually a pretty cool guy if you actually use him the right way. I just don't see him being Uber. You could stop him with Stealth Rock and probably Aqua Jet or something. Why ban it to Ubers? I could see banning X Control to Ubers though. That thing is like a monster in Sandstorm. It's got like 600 speed or something, and it can outspeed pretty much everything, even if they're Choice Scarfed. And then after, if they have a uh, Sword Stance, you're in trouble. So I could see X Control being in Ubers, but that's my thoughts on that subject. Uh. Nothing much to say except that this was recorded at night time. So I really couldn't say good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, or something like that. And yeah, I think I'm going to shut this off now. I'm getting bored. See ya.